Wow. It's amazing to me. You would think when people see the error of their ways, they say, well, you know, I was wrong. Let me stop right here. But that doesn't happen with this administration that we have here in the White House. They continuously make bad decision after bad decision. After seeing the NFL's response to the statements made by the President of the United States, he decides to double down. And when he doubles down, he goes all in. And when he went all in, he thought it would be in his best interest to continuously challenge the NFL owners to punish the players and not join side with the NFL or they're going to suffer. Now, needless to say, celebrities like Jay-Z, uh, Mark Cuban, uh, Pitbull, a lot of these artists are buying planes and putting so that people can load the planes with supplies and food so they can take to Puerto Rico, not waiting on President Trump. So the president, in the history of this country, the president has never made a trip or why is he t is taking him two weeks to get to Puerto Rico? He hadn't even been on the land in their disaster. And he's talking about logistics. We're talking about the Atlantic Ocean. It's not like a trip down to Texas or Florida. We're talking about the Atlantic Ocean. No one's asking you to swim the Atlantic Ocean to get to Puerto Rico. You have an Air Force jet plane an air force one plane i don't think uh a presidential plane has ever had a problem getting to puerto rico so i don't understand why would there be a problem now that logistics would be a problem for you to get to puerto rico and that you can only arrive on tuesday but you can continuously find time to bash players in the NFL. It's a misdirectional grab. Now, do you, anybody who believes that, oh my God, the NFL's in trouble. Trump's going to do this to him. He's going to do that. It's retarded because these are billionaires who put you in office. Billionaires. And you're talking about messing up their money? Let's say people did do that and it messed up the NFL's money. Who You, you want to be the face of that blame? Do you think because you're in a White House chair that you got power over these billionaires? See, during election time, money gives power a run for its money. And when you are basically a slave to votes where they're not, money really gives, <laughs> gives you a run for its money. Don't mess. And this is the message the NFL owners were sending Donald Trump. Don't bite the hand that feeds you and supports you. We donated millions to you. But we got billions. Do you want to play? That's what all this was about. Do you want to play? And I don't think the president wants to play. He's going to realize his position real soon. And that will be that. But all of this is a distraction. To... Throw it away the attention of the lack of support he's been giving Puerto Rico. Don't be fooled.